The allegations that William Ragg made on Thursday morning were extraordinary, explosive. He says that some of his Conservative MP uh, colleagues, in particular those who potentially want a vote of confidence in Boris Johnson, have been subjected to bullying and intimidation that may, he argues, constitute blackmail, although Boris Johnson and some of his Cabinet ministers have said they have seen no evidence for that. Now, in a story first reported in The Telegraph and confirmed in a conversation I have had with William Ragg, he says that next week, early next week, he's meeting with an officer, a detective from the Metropolitan Police to discuss these allegations, although that does not necessarily mean an investigation will be launched. Why is he doing this? Well, partly because he doesn't want to be uh, bullied himself. He wants this to be taken seriously. There has certainly, over the last 24 hours, been a pretty uh, brutal briefing campaign against him. That is not abnormal uh, here in Westminster, but it certainly helps substantiate uh, some of his claims about the uh, culture within uh, this place. He's also doing this because, of course, he believes that a crime or crimes potentially have been committed. And this is clearly an escalation uh, in the battles that are going on within the Conservative Party in Westminster, battles that don't really seem particularly sustainable at this point. And that is before we get to next week, where we are expecting that all-important report from Sue Gray about events and parties that have taken place within a government, and in particular, within Number 10.